You held a key in one hand, a butcher's knife in the other. The hand you dealt me was the same hand you also dealt my mother. I stood fragile, lost, and craving your voice. I am an open wound from the hand of your choice. A wound which heals itself to be slashed again, but deeper. My heart's grown cold over the years. It's so much weaker. It no longer bleeds that thick red blood, full of loss, of grief in you. It's now a black sea of abyss that runs right through. You butchered something you could have called your own. You damaged the creation that you then chose to disown. You couldn't claim me. Therefore, you wouldn't know. How your absence has forced me to grow. This growth has served me. But my heart still struggles to beat. Its chamber needs unlocking and it's you that holds the key. Claim your throne. I want to see your eyes. I need to see myself in you. Your rotten little life. And deep down there's a love locked inside. And you, the ruler of me, hold that key, do you realise that you could have dealt the other hand and chosen to use that key and save me, set me free, had the best of me and been the king of me. Then I could have been a princess. Who wants to be a princess when they can be the queen? <laughs> Stepping off that beauteous throne was the greatest gift you gave to me. And what I've come to realize when you stepped on down, you paved a way so victorious and handed me the crown.